Thank you to cap it. Finally got that back window sealed. See it. Brand new. Wow, that feels nice. It's been a while. All right, spur of the moment kind of thing. What's different about this old guy? Canopy's off. She should have a, a fresh cap on tomorrow though. Big things to come. We're driving up uh, Vancouver Island to Campbell River to pick up the new topper. Hopefully it all works out. It fits well, it looks good, it doesn't leak, all that fun stuff. Yeah, close to it. Oh yeah, it's a little easier than two people just moving it. Alrighty. What's up guys, welcome to this week's episode. Today we're doing something a little different because we're turning this uninsulated truck canopy into a fully insulated truck topper. We have a bunch of special marine carpet we're hoping to attach to this today and make sure that this is fully insulated for winter camping. So uh, stay tuned. Make it nice and cozy. Cool, 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 cool. Interesting position for sure. What a technique, eh? Yeah, I kind of have ever seen something quite like it. We made it. Do a little scrub a dub dub to clean it up and then do a little spray, spray, spray. Never done this before, so. It's gonna be a process. Got four rolls of carpet. It's already processed getting that damn canopy. All right, guys, welcome to the next day. Day two. Day two. We did a ton of other stuff yesterday and kind of got sidetracked, but today we're doing the canopy. The carpet jet black. <laughs> so this is marine carpet, speaker carpet. This is clearly the inside and this is the nice soft outside. It actually feels really soft, which is lovely. Three feet by six feet, covering 24 feet. Just did a bit of sealing, as you can tell. I gotta do some measure twice, cut once. Yesterday, we also just did the drawers as well, re-waterproofed them and sealed them all up, which was really nice. Cause they kind of get messed up after a while, being in the back of the truck, taking in water and everything. We're using a 3M 90. I actually had to get this off Facebook Marketplace cause I couldn't find it in Vancouver. Uh, in store. I think it's like a more available in America maybe. Or I'm just not good at finding things. <laughs> we'll roll a quarter of it up, then we'll spray both sides, and we'll put it down. Roll it this way. Yeah. So got the main piece down. Now we gotta go through and do some fine little cuts. Cut out the Whatever those are. All right, we've made major progress. I can tell you this is a sweaty, painful process that is not easy. It's so long. And I honestly don't even know if I'd recommend it. But it looks pretty good. I do a pretty vacuum. We still got to do the inside of this part, as you can see. I think we might do that when the truck is on. Yeah, we're gonna put the truck on. But we're just gonna do a quick vacuum and then... Put it on. All right, let's put it on the truck and see how it looks. It's 
a bit of a patch off, but oh, that's nice. Gotta do the edges at some point. Maybe not today, but 